Hey everyone, this is Flight Streamer. On one of the recent streams, I've demonstrated how to land a Cessna 172 during an engine failure on a typical circuit after takeoff in Microsoft Flight Simulator. Now let's hop on the real plane and demonstrate a maneuver called Power Off 180 or a simulated engine failure. In this case, it's a Diamond DA40 that I fly in real life. To make things more interesting and challenging, I've picked a very windy day. Today, we have a 70 degree crosswind from the west with gusts up to 25 knots. For obvious reasons, we do not shut the engine down, but in order to simulate the engine failure condition, we fully idle the throttle. It's a perfect way to practice and be ready for real emergencies if they do occur. First thing to do during an engine failure is to pitch for the best glide speed. For DA40, it's 73 knots, but since we do have gusty wind conditions, and we're making a continuous turn, it's best to maintain 80 knots until short final. And by the way, the highway you see in the video is 407, where the recent famous landing occurred that you saw in the news. We only have one option, so it's very critical to judge the glide and make necessary corrections. Now if it's apparent that you can't make the runway, 407 is indeed the best option. Since we have lots of buildings, it's best to be a bit high and fast, the runway is pretty long, so by applying full flaps you can easily slow down. The high pitch sound you hear is a stall horn. Unlike Cessna, DA40 stall horn is very sensitive so it picks up gusts even with airspeed higher than normal glide, so it's perfectly normal. Now watch what happens next. Do you see those tiny dots on the right hand side of the edge of the runway? Yep, these are geese. It was very hard to spot them during a short final, so we've only noticed them once we flew up beam the runway edge. So that's it, that's how you typically practice to land a plane if engine failure occurs during a circuit. I hope you enjoyed this video, give it a like, share and leave a comment. I'd like to give a special thanks to my monthly supporters. Your ongoing support helps the stream and making real world flying content like this. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Cheers.